Hello everyone, my name is Lovina. Hello, my name is Kevin Satria. And my name is Vincenzo Gerard. Guys, do you still remember last March 2020, our beloved country was visited by the unexpected one and until now it still hasn't gone? Yes, you're right. In March 2020, our country declared the first case of coronavirus and the story about coronavirus began after that. Do you know if the coronavirus isn't the first pandemic disease in this world and in our country? In 1347 until 1351, we had a black death. In 1918, we had H1N1 or as usual we called Spanish flu. And seven years ago, our world had a pandemic disease again. We called the pandemic disease Ebola virus. So, what can we do to make the coronavirus go away immediately? Maybe a lot of us already knew or maybe already did it. Like using a mask, always washing your hands, and doing social distancing. But, but have you ever thought that in certain places, Social distancing is not an easy thing to do. For example, social distancing in a dense area. Kecamatan Tambora, Kelurahan Kalianyar merupakan wilayah paling padat penduduknya di wilayah DKI Jakarta. Tak hanya berdempetan, gang rumah juga sempit dengan lebar 1 meter. Di RT 03 RW 07, jumlah warga sekitar 420 hidup selama puluhan tahun dengan kondisi rumah yang berdempetan dan ukuran rumah yang kecil. Sudah bersama saya kita akan menyapa Sekretaris RW. Selamat siang Pak, dengan Bapak siapa? Selamat siang dengan Bapak Ferry Setiawan. Bapak Ferry Setiawan. Pak Ferry, kita tadi sudah sempat berkeliling. Melihat kondisi di sini, ya. itu ada apa, rumahnya itu kan saling berdempetan ya Pak ya. ya. Gangnya juga... Bisa dikatakan lebar ini sempit gitu kan Pak. Ya, ini gimana Pak untuk menjamin bahwa warga di sini tuh menerapkan physical distancing atau jaga jarak gitu? Kita hanya menerapkan physical distancing secara mandiri. Pak. Then, what could be the solution? Moreover, independent isolation is the only way if the hospital condition are full. Don't worry, because we will bring a solution namely pandemic health. Before that, let's see the government sustainable development. We expected to achieve sustainable development goals number three about good health and well-being. So, are you guys want to know more about this idea? Let's talk more about this. Pandemic house is a house that built for reduced direct contact with the people closest to us. while simultaneously reducing the spread of the virus. The land size of this pandemic house is assumed to be 5 meter multiply 7 meter. This size is our group assumption for the research is needed to get a clear picture of the size of this pandemic house. In this pandemic house, there is an isolation room where the function of this room is a place of isolation. If one of the family member is exposed to virus, it is assumed that in one isolation room can be filled by two people. If no family member has the virus, this room can be used as a normal bedroom. In our pandemic house, we have two bedroom. First bedroom for parents and the second bedroom for their child. So, in our pandemic house can only for four person. to parents and to child. In our pandemic house, we have exhaust fan in each of bathroom. The function of exhaust fan is make the air circulation better. Because if the air circulation better, the patient who infected by coronavirus can help again in immediately. When a family member is exposed to the virus, his family member must wear personal protective equipment or PPA, such as a mask and a strict distancing, so as not to cause transmission of the virus among family members. We realized that in implementing independent isolation, a family cannot walk alone. It takes strong cooperation between the community, neighbors, and the government. The community can help by providing support in the form of food. 
so that families who are undergoing independent isolation can focus on healing. How? Interesting, right? Hopefully, this idea can inspire friends who have watched it and our beloved country Indonesia. Oh yeah, he wants to remind all of you to stay safe by always washing your hands, using masks, and doing social distancing during this pandemic. See you next time. Bye-bye.